Now, two years ago, we told you how one of Yorkshire's top brass bands was fighting for survival because they didn't have much brass. The lack of sponsor and raising costs meant that running Carlton Main Frickley Brass Band was almost impossible. It's a good story, this, but despite being in dire financial straits, the band, which is based in South Emsall, has managed to keep going. At the weekend, they were crowned Yorkshire area champions, beating the likes of Black Dyke and Grimethorpe to take the top title. Here's Ian White. The Colton Main Frickley Colliery Band, that's the noise they make, what a great sound it is, and here is proof, look, that they are Yorkshire area champions, there's the trophy Ray Sykes, you've been associated with this band for so many years, you must be really proud, because things were looking really grim two years when we were last, uh, last year, weren't they? First of all, proudest man in Yorkshire. And yes, they were looking grim. Um, but uh, we've got to carry on. Um, we don't get any finance at all in the band. Uh, we just go on and play. But Ray, how can you be the, the most successful band in Yorkshire and not have any sponsorship? Well, if we got sponsorship, we'd be the best band in the world, wouldn't we? Simple as that. But why have you not got that support? I just don't know. Um, I mean, we were Yorkshire champions this year. We were third at the Yorkshire area last year. We were champions year before. We've represented Yorkshire on six occasions out of seven years. You know, how much better can you get? And someone said that you were... Uh, it was good to see underdogs doing well, but that's not the case at all, is it? It's certainly not. If we're an underdog... <laughs> my word. And we've got two of the uh, ladies who play in the band here, Jess and Kirsty. Jess, why do you do it? Because you have to give up your spare time for this. Yeah, I think it's a bit of an addiction once you've started it's a good sense of like togetherness and camaraderie and we all come here and help each other and play for each other and then when you win it's an added bonus absolutely and Kirsty, you won a personal award as well didn't you just tell us what that was yes i did i won the best instrumentalist prize wow so that's one hell of an achievement isn't it my goodness well done to you thank you very much indeed ladies ray so you've got the albert hall coming up later in the year yes we have um, You've just got to get there and pay for it. <laughs> yeah, we've just heard that the um, we've just had news that the Rugby World Cup is on the same weekend, and all the uh, hotels have doubled in price, so it's going to be even harder to get down there. But if we have to set off at two o'clock in the morning and play on the same day, we will do. Well, look, let's hear, let's show the viewers and let them hear why this is uh, a championship-winning uh, band. Here we go. <laughs> Love that. Brilliant. Tell you what, if you've got some brass to spare, go and support them because you'll make them yeah. world champions. The Albert Hall. Love that, well. don't you? Love that. Yeah. Actually, that, that's the comp.